Well, good day, boys and girls, girls and boys. And welcome back to Noel's Garden Tractors and Fires. And today we have another fire going. I'm a little late getting out today. I had to go get some groceries this morning, so that's the normal Monday morning task. Not much going on here today, but I'm just going to show you outside and from what I've been hearing and reading, a lot of people are getting the same thing today. But one fella was hoping that he, it was going to come down as hot water, but I don't think it'll ever come down as hot water. Anyway, it's a good idea. <laughs> anyway, there we go. There's a lot of places today I think are getting that. And uh, the place is here too. So. But there's certainly not enough out there to even bother taking the tractor out to do anything. So. And it's right around the zero degrees Celsius. So. Uh, it's kind of like a wet snow, snowman snow, or heart attack snow, whatever way you want to call, call it. So, yeah, I'll probably just leave it and uh, drive over with the vehicles. I think it'll back down and that'll make a, a base maybe. And it is supposed to be for the next four to five, six days just below zero. So it might might melt a little bit through the day, but through the night it will certainly stay gross. So anyway, I uh, got a little project I'm gonna do here, so I'll just shut you off for now and I'll get back to you in a minute. Alright, this is one of these little jobs that should only take five minutes. What? Five minutes. And you know what happens to them kind of jobs. Anyway, I'm going to start up the tractor here. Just for a second. Today is something I forgot to do, I guess. But uh, those shoes on the plow. I gotta I gotta turn them over. I have them up like that so that summertime of use basically. Should put a little bit of stuff on there. Yeah. I can't remember which way to go. This way, I think, because they're uh, bent to match the file. They don't, they wouldn't sit straight when I first did this. This was already on the file. These we bought separately from somewhere. But I had to bend them. I heat them and bend them so that they kind of fit the angle of the plow. So I'm going to put a little bit of any C's on that. Where do I have my any C's? Over here somewhere? For this five minute job. Five minutes. 
That's the wrong stuff. Suppose you could use grease or what have you. Now the other part of this I don't remember. Now, 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 brown cow. Don't forget. And a little bit here, too, I think. I think we're going to go some way around there, I'd say. Wherever it happens to go. There. Now, there's one side. Now I'm going to start the tractor again. I'll take this off because it'll fall down. The studio light, so we can't have that. We can set you up over here now, and we can see this side. I think these are uh, something my son got at his work, I think. They're just an aftermarket skid shoe. Basically anything, I guess. the thing to do. Alright, now Try to 
put it the same as the other one, I guess. Oh, I don't bend with these either. There, all right. Ten minute job. That was supposed to be five minutes. Anyway, I guess that's not so bad. And, uh, nothing went wrong and uh, no curse words were said. Let's go. So we'll uh, get a little start here. And then we'll just set her down and see what happens. that for now and that'll <clears throat> well whenever I take it out because I do my driveway is not perfectly level it is pavement old old pavement but it's broke up here and there and there's some rock dust down at this end that I put in so once it gets froze it wouldn't be too bad but right now I guess that wouldn't be so bad anyway because the shoes will dig into the ground and lower the plow a bit until it gets froze. Anyway, I'm going to zoom you in over to here. I can't get to it at the moment because of that being in the way. Look at that. Oh my God, that's something that. Yes, sir. I don't like that. Now, if you can see that right there, the caterpillar can. Now I'm kind of shaky here because of the zoom in. Now that caterpillar can is a can of anti-seize that my father had. That can is 40 to 50 years old, maybe more. Anyway, it's kind of funny. The instructions on that can says, clean all the parts in gasoline. Now, if you did that today, you'd be you'd be thrown in jail. But that's what it says on that can. Anyway, just something kind of funny. So there we go. Something done today. My. My sand didn't come yet, so I'm expecting that maybe this week. I don't like bothering the young fella. He's, he's busy too, but anyway, we'll get her someday. And it's supposed to continue snowing until midnight. But like I say, it's not going to amount to anything. So we'll leave her at that, and uh, well, you have a great day, and if you're out in the snow clearness today, good for you, because <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> have fun. <laughs> Should have a cab on your tractor, that's the main thing. Anybody who doesn't have a cab should have one, as far as I can see. They're the greatest thing, especially with heated seats. Keeps the things warm, you know, the things I'm meaning. There now, that's it. All right, have a good day.